very good morning to all. My name is Aishwarya Suri Narayanan and today I welcome you all to the morning podcast. Firstly, we have Aisha and Zoya with the Quran recitation and translation. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. A'udhu billahi minash shaytanir rajeem. Bismillahir rahmanir rahim. Qaf wa al-Qur'an al-Majeed. Bal ajibu In the name of Allah, the most gracious, the most merciful, come by the honored Quran. By the wonder that there has come to them a warner from among themselves, and the disbelievers say, This is an amazing thing. When we have died and have become dust, will we return to life? This is distant return. We know what the earth declined with us in a retaining record, but they denied the truth when it came to them. So they are in a confused condition. Have we not looked at the heaven above them, how we have structured it and furnished it, and how it has no risk? Thank you. Thank you, Asha and Zoya. Coming up next, we have Prajakta with the word today. As you know, in this segment, you will come across interesting words to improve vocabulary. Good morning to all. I am Prajakta. The word for the day is confectionery, spelled as C-O-N-F-E-C-T-I-O-N-E-R-Y. Confectionery is the art of making treats which are rich in sugar and carbohydrates. Thank you. Thank you, Prajakta. Now, I'd like to call upon R.P. to present the thought for the day. Respected teachers and my dear friends, today I, RP, stand before you to present the thought for the day. The thought for the day is the same people who are candy to our eyes can be poison to our hearts. Study their ingredients before feeding them to your soul. I repeat, the thought for the day is the same people who are candy to our eyes can be poison to our hearts. Study their ingredients before feeding them to your soul. Thank you. Wonderful. Gopika is up next to give us information on World Candy Day. A very good morning to one and all. Today, my sister Gopika uh, stand before you all to speak a few lines about World Candy Day. World Candy Day is a sweet way to celebrate all the different kinds of candies eaten by people all over the world. It was established by the National Confectionery Association in a world in a world where consumers demand more and more information about the food they eat the awareness month is also an opportunity to educate consumers allowing them to make informed choices about their favorite confectionery always a treat innovative launched by the NCA aims to go one step further than providing information about what it is that the consumers are purchasing but also offers advice and guidelines on portion control and consumption of sweet treats. 
as a part of balanced lifestyle. Unique machines were invented to make the production of candies simpler, among which some are in 1847, invention of candy press making it possible to produce multiple shapes and sizes of different candies at one time. In 1851, confectionery began revolving steam pan to assist in boiling sugar. So let's get involved to some candy and eat candies responsibly. Thank you. It was very interesting and informative for our daily dose of current affairs and world news. Dennis is up next. Good morning, teachers and my dear friends. I, today I am going to present the latest headlines from around the world. Qatar News. Qatar working to transform into a smart country and revolutionize the way in transportation and logistics are managed. Qatar to be building a large carbon dioxide storage plant to sequester 5 million tons of carbon dioxide from its LNG facilities by 2025. India News. Prime Minister Narendra Modi holds talks with leaders of three key maritime neighbors of India. International News Google buys smartwatch company Fitbit for $2.8 billion. Thank you and have a nice day. Thanks, Kenneth. And now, to add a musical touch to our proceedings, I would like to call upon Rashika, Ruth, Aradhana, Michelle, Nili, Kiara, and Afia with a beautiful song.
Thank you and have a great day.